Hi guys, uh, greetings of the day myself uh, Vijay Tavardhan and in this uh, video session we are going to discuss about an isometric projections and an example is like this a sphere diameter 60 millimeter is placed centrally on a top face of a square prism side 60 millimeter and height 70 millimeter draw the isometric projections of the combination so according to this uh, the orthographic projection is going to look like this that is a sphere is placed centrally on a square prism like this now let me show you how to construct the scene in the isometric projections so for by choosing a line command with a thickness of 0 0.5 and a continuous line uh, we shall show you how to construct a square base first and then the square base is going to be converted into a prism now the size of the square base is 60 millimeter so now let me draw a 60 30 then 60 150 60 minus 115 and get back to the first portion or 60 minus 30 and after which uh, one has to get the center of this uh, square so this is going to be the center of the square and whose height is given as 70 millimeter and after drawing a vertical height of 70 millimeter this line is going to be represented in the form of a chain line because it is a representation of a axis and after drawing an axis so one can draw the uh, one can uh, go for a move command move this lamina from the bottom base and it has to be kept at the top base over here like this with the end point symbol and then using a line command with 0.5 mm as a thickness and a continuous line one can draw the visible longer edges of the given solid like this and after drawing these things the invisible edges can be deleted or it can be retained as a thin line if at all if it is required and the construction of this rectangular square prism has been completed as per the given dimensions and after which one has to construct a sphere of diameter 60 millimeter for which we know that the axis value will be 30 millimeter and so we will have the 30 millimeter axis so this is going to be the center of the sphere now once we get the center of the sphere now one can select the figure or the isometric drawing then we will go for a scale command then we have to reduce it to the isometric scale factor of 0.8164 times then one can get the isometric projections of the square prism and after which using a circle by center point command so one can draw a true radius or two diameter of a circle and it should be positioned exactly on the position or the center what we already located like this and however the line thickness is 0.5 and it should be a continuous line then make use of a trim command one can remove the invisible portions of the solids like this now one can say that the problem is completed in all aspects now if you are having any sort of doubts you please feel free to contact me and please make a note that whenever spear is there the spear radius should be reduced to isometric scale but not the spear diameter so this is a very important note and if you like this video please press the like button and also you can share and subscribe to my youtube channel and also you can press the bell icon to get the latest video updates as and when it is going to be uploaded in my youtube channel thanks for watching this video guys